Hey everyone, uh, this is Dr. Mungli. So today I am going to explain you uh, one of the question which is uh, the source of this question is uh, Kaplan uh, Medicals. This question is about uh, enzyme kinetics. The question says ki kinetic analysis of the tyrosine kinase activities in normal and transformed cells is shown below. So the line weaver Burke plot is shown here. So the plot that you are seeing here, this is line weaver Burke plot. And uh, as you might be knowing that in line weaver Burke plot, x axis it shows the substrate concentration in reciprocal, whereas y axis it shows uh, velocity of the reaction in uh, reciprocal. And also you can see there that there are two lines here. Velocity uh, lines are given here. One is for normal cells, other is the tumor cells. Now the question is, which of the following conclusions is best supported by these results? If you take a look at the results here, so the normal cell line and the tumor cell line, velocity curve, so they both meet at the same point here. And also note that the point that they meet on the x-axis is on the left side of the zero indicating that it is a basically that point is minus 1 over km. So they meet at the same point it means they both have same substrate it means same affinity for the enzyme so their km is same so km is not altered here. Whereas the velocity of these two lines, they are different. As you can see that in the y-axis, they meet at different points. See the normal cell, this is the y-axis, this is where it meets. Whereas the tumor cell line, it meets, meets below the normal line on the y-axis. Means it is going towards the zero. And also you should remember that in line weaver Burke plot all these things are in reciprocal anything that is coming towards zero it means the value is increased if you go by these two lines so the normal cell lines velocity that is v max of normal cell line and the v max of tumor cells the enzyme ca uh, catalysis in tumor cells v max so actually it is increased in comparison to normal cells. So the Vmax of tumor cells increased. Why? Because the velocity, the curve here, it is nearer to zero compared to normal cell. That is what uh, is, you need to interfere, I mean, uh, uh, interpret from the line weaver Burke plot here. So Km is same. Km is same for both the lines, both the enzymes, normal cell line and tumor cell line. Km is same whereas Vmax is increased. Now let's see which of which one of the following choices make sense here. Let's go to the choice A. Choice A says a tumor cell kinase has a higher than normal affinity for ATPs. So higher than normal affinity, what this means? Higher than normal affinity means its Km should be decreased means lower the Km, higher the affinity. So Km should have been decreased, means tumor cell cell line Km should have been decreased. So that, as, as we have already seen, the Km remains same. Km between means between the normal cells and tumor cell kinases, Km is same, whereas the option A says that higher than the normal affinity indicating that Km is lowered or Km is decreased, so that doesn't really fit here. If just in case if you want to see how the Km is decreased, how that line would have you would have seen. So if I try to draw that here, so I'll I'll draw, draw the normal line, normal cell ki kinetics, something like this. This is normal, consider this is normal. Whereas the tumor cell line, so I'll write tumor cell line kinetics means Km is decreased. Km is decreased means it should be away from zero here because this is 1 over km so it should be something like this it should have been something like this okay so the km is away from zero this is the tumor cell kinase km is away from zero it means km is decreased km decrease means it will have higher affinity for the substrate anyway 
that kind of thing is not shown here in this graph so you need not worry about that part so that means option a is incorrect we have something uh, some another other option which is similar to option a and that is option e here let's look at option e option e says that tumor cell kinase has lower than normal affinity lower than normal affinity lower than our normal affinity means km is increased it indicates that km is increased increased km increased km means lower uh, decreased affinity actually km is it indicates it is negatively correlates with the affinity higher the km lower the affinity lower the km higher the affinity so whereas we have already seen that in this particular in these two lines km remains same so that it is not means km is not really increased here if you just want to if you would like to see how the km is increased how you can see that in line viewer work plot i am drawing that again consider this is the normal cell line normal tumor cell, uh, normal cell kinase is there so if i am writing tumor cell kinase km is means increased km increased km looks something like this which is nearer to zero so this is what is the km here is the vmax so vmax is increased here that's fine but km is also increased this point is down here k in, there is increase in the km increase in the km means decrease in the affinity affinity is decreased so it is nearer to zero anything that is nearer to zero indicates that there is increase in the km so anyway that kind of lines also you are not seeing here in the given question so that means option e here that is also incorrect now let's see the option b option b says a kinase gene has been deleted from tumor cell genome if the kinase gene has been deleted then tumor cannot synthesize kinase because gene itself is deleted it means you don't really see any velocity curve here because tumor cell do not have any kinase so that is why option b is incorrect now let's see option c option c says a non competitive inhibitor has been synthesized in the tumor cells so before you get into this questions you need to know what is the effect of non competitive inhibitor on enzyme kinetics so the non competitive inhibitor it it do not compete with the substrate but what it does is it's going to bind to a substrate to a site other than the active site by binding to site other than the active site what this non competitive inhibitor does is is going to change the conformation of an active site because of this what happens substrate binds to an active site but it do not fit well because it do not fit well because the binding energy is not coming the proper binding process is not going on because there is a change in the conformation of an active site in the presence of non competitive inhibitor that is why the velocity of the reaction goes down it means substrate is not going to be converted into product overall if we take the overall enzymes so and plot plot the curve so how do you see the line viewer work plot in the presence of non competitive inhibitor consider this is the normal line here normal enzyme and in the presence of non competitive inhibitor so it do not really affect the km but it affects velocity of the reaction so basically non competitive inhibitor it line shows something like this this is an in the presence of non competitive inhibitor so it means km remains same here they both the, they both meet at the same point km is same in the non in the presence of non competitive inhibitor this part is fine here but velocity of the reaction is decreased because as you can see it is going away from zero it means velocity is maximum velocity in the presence of non competitive inhibitor decreased because this line it will go away from zero whereas in the question line is going towards zero means velocity should is increased here so this particular choice looks very close to the answer but the change is here in the velocity velocity is decreased in the presence of non competitive inhibitor whereas this particular question it shows that velocity is increased that is why option c is incorrect now let's move on to see option d option d says a kinase gene has been amplified in tumor cell genome so in the gene has been amplified it means there is more quantity or more concentration of 
kinase has been synthesized so as you increase the enzyme concentration along with the substrate concentration as you can expect there is a linearity in the curve so as you go on increasing the substrate and also increase the enzyme maximum velocity of the reaction increases it means v max increases and km remains same that is why if you look at the look at all the options here so option d it makes sense because option d it shows there is increase in the concentration of enzyme so this is about enzyme kinetics question which i have taken from kaplan medicals i hope this has helped you to understand little bit about enzyme kinetics especially its km vmax increase in km decrease in km increase in velocity of the reaction maximum velocity decrease in maximum velocity of the reaction and something about non competitive inhibition so the non competitive inhibitor where the km remains same non competitive inhibitor km is same vmax is decreased and also note that in competitive inhibitor competitive inhibitor where it increases the apparent km but the maximum velocity is decreased on this you can watch video on competitive and non competitive inhibitor in my youtube channel thanks for watching i'll come up with some other video some other time thank you